Partnerships, Part 1. Hi, I'm Daniel D'Souza and welcome to Aptitude Academy. Today's topic is going to be on partnerships. This section of Aptitude usually gives you a statement like this. You have three friends that have invested in a business. Each of them has put in a different amount of money for a different amount of time. At the end of the year, you get a profit. Now, the problem statement is that you have to find out the profit of each individual as per their investments. Let's get started. A partnership is basically a business venture that has two or more people that have invested some money in it. Now, these people are called as partners. The profits need to be divided accordingly. Now, let's see two cases how this is done. Case one, same time periods. Let us say we have two partners, A and B. A has invested rupees X and B has invested rupees Y for the same time period, one year. When you get your profits, they're divided accordingly in the same ratio. Now, A gets X amount of the profit and B gets Y amount of the profit. Now, you can also have that they both invest different amounts of money for different amounts of time. That is case two. Case two is different time periods. A has invested rupees X for only P amount of months and B has invested rupees Y for Q months. Now, when your profit comes, the ratios will be A gets X into P amount of the profit. That is how much money has in invested into the amount of months and B gets Y into Q. That is B has invested rupees Y for Q months. Hence, you see that the profit not only depends upon how much money is involved, but also the time period for which it is invested in. All right, now let's go through a simple problem and work it out step by step. Problem. Three friends A, B and C started a business by investing 1,20,000, 1,35,000 and 1,50,000 respectively. Find out the share of each out of an annual profit of rupees 56,700. Now the first step in the problem is to make your ratios. Ratio of investments. Now, A has invested 1,20,000. B has invested 1,35,000 and C has invested 1,50,000. Now, in solving the ratios, one simple trick is to find a common. Now, you know that there are three, three, three zeros here, 1,000. So, remove them all completely. This will help you simplify a ratio. Now, you also see that the difference is 15. And we know that 15 tens are 150. So, you can see this is 10, 15 tens are, 15 nines are, and 15 eights are. So, your ratio boils down to 8 is to 9 is to 10. The sum of which is 27. So you can see A has 8 parts out of every 27. So A's share will be 8 by 27 of the total profit that is 56,700. This comes out to be 16,800. This is how you find A's share. Similarly B's share will be 9 upon 27 into 56,700 and C 10 by 27 into 56,700. This was part one. We just saw the basics of partnership and we solved a simple problem. In the next video, I'll solve many more tougher problems. Do subscribe to my channel and like this video. Thank you. Subscribe to my channel to show me your support and I'll continue making many more videos. Thank you.